Hey everyone, it's Pat from Seattle Coffee Gear, and today I've got three of our picks for some of the best super automatic espresso machines that you can get in 2022, plus an honorable mention. So we're gonna run through our categories for these machines. We've got our crowd pleaser pick, we've got our top features pick, we've got our ultimate choice, and then we've got our honorable mention as well. So let's get into it and talk about our crowd pleaser pick, which is gonna be the Philips Carina Latte Go. So this machine is super simple to use and it has super simple function, which is just push the button for the coffee that you want and then you're gonna get it. It's got a built-in milk steaming craft called the Latte Go. This is a really great craft steamer. It's so much easier to use than a lot of other steaming systems. Uh, it produces really great milk results, especially considering how horrible this machine is. And it's really easy to take apart and clean it and maintain it. And really that ease of use combined with the maintenance being super easy on this machine and uh, the price point of it is why we have it in this crowd pleaser slot because it's going to be just the perfect pick for a lot of people who wanna get into some home espresso and wanna do it with the machine that's super easy to use and to maintain. So you're gonna be able to do your cappuccinos and espresso and latte and hot water options on this machine. You just push the button and you get your drink. In terms of cleaning, you just have to manage cleaning the, uh, the carafe. Occasionally, you'll need to clean the brew unit that's inside. And then you've also got an uh, AquaClean filtration filter that's going to keep the water fresh running through the machine so that you're going to get maximize your time between descalings. So really, that's kind of the long and short of it. I mean, this has a nice big bean hopper on top that is, uh, has, has a nice seal on it. You've got a bypass doser and um, it makes really great drinks, especially considering the price point and, and, and how easy it is to use. So really great pick for you if you're looking for something simple and affordable to get on your countertop to get automatic espresso. Next up for our top features pick, we've got the Seiko Excelsis. Philips Seiko are very similar. They're, they're kind of sister companies and they have uh, similar brew components inside but the Excelsis kind of takes everything up a notch by offering a huge range of programmability through its touchscreen interface. It's super, super easy to use. You don't really even need to know that much about what kind of coffee you wanna get because there's so many different fun features to play with and programmable options to play with that you're gonna have a great time just kind of tweaking everything and finding the perfect coffee for you. It's also got really incredible milk texture, like much more impressive than what we see on most automatic systems with the use of its Hygestim system. Uh, it also keeps it clean with this little insert down here. It helps to clean the steam wand, which is really important, and it's done really well here. It comes with a carafe that you can store your milk in and put in the fridge and then pull it out and just slide the steam wand right in it and then get your steamed milk. You're going to be able to get a ton of different drink types and options using this touchscreen, and basically you can program whatever kind of recipe you want for those different drinks, you can change volume, strength, you can change temperature, all of that stuff is totally adjustable and you can save it to your profile and repeat it over and over again. This machine also has AquaClean filtration, so it's just as easy to maintain as the Carina that we talked about a minute ago, which means that it's gonna be both a really robust, powerful option and one that is still pretty easy to use and very easy to maintain. So that's why we have it here in this top feature slot, because it's gonna be great for anybody who really wants a premium super automatic machine that's gonna give you all kinds of different options uh, without necessarily stepping up above the $2,000 mark. So great machine, our top features pick, and we're really happy with it. That's the Seiko Excelsis. Finally, we've got the Mila CM6360, which is our ultimate pick for this category. So this machine is gonna be the most expensive of the machines that we've got on the countertop, but it's also just an awesome super automatic espresso machine. So you have tons of programmability, you can save to a bunch of different profiles, you get 10 plus drink recipes per profile, and it's got all kinds of features on it. You've got your hot water spout, you've got milk steaming, it's also got a carafe that you can get that is going to give you that same kind of ability to store your milk in the thing that steams, it comes from the steam. So it's really convenient from that perspective and ton of really easy to use maintenance and troubleshooting features through the screen, which is really nice. Not that we see many issues with these machines, but basically you can get full information about what's going on with the machine through that screen, similarly to the Excelsis. Uh, but this machine also has a very quiet grinder. That's one of the upgrades with this line of newer line of Mila machines is that it's gonna have a 
frankly like whisper quiet grinder. I've, it's the quietest grinder I've heard, I think. And then it also offers really incredible milk texture, even surprisingly a bit of a step up over the Excelsis, which is when the Excelsis came out, I didn't think that I would be saying that for a super automatic espresso machine. So the milk texture on this machine is amazing. You get all of those programming options. It's got a times two button, so you can just easily make two drinks quickly. And all around, it's just a really premium package that is kind of gonna be the ultimate choice, which is why we have it in this pick for this category, for getting a super automatic espresso machine on your countertop. Couldn't recommend it more. We also have, as an honorable mention, the Philips 4300 Latte Go. So this machine obviously looks very similar to the Carina. It's kind of an in-between point between the Carina and the Excelsis. So we wanted to talk about it here because if you like the screen aspect of the Excelsis and you like some of the more advanced programming features of the Excelsis and more drink options, the 4300 is a really good go-to if you don't actually want to step all the way up from a price perspective to the Excelsis. So it uses the Latte Go steaming system that's easy to clean that we talked about with the Carina, but it includes more programming features and the screen can also, similarly to these other machines, give you lots of good diagnostic information about what's going on with the machine, helps you to remember to change the filter, and it helps you to remember when to do different kinds of cleanings and can walk you through those kinds of cleanings as well. So really solid machine if you wanna go kind of in between that Carina level and these more expensive machines. And that's why we wanted to include it as an honorable mention for this category. So I hope that this video has helped you kind of maybe make a decision on which one of these machines might be the right fit for you. We think all of them are really great, really great value at their different price points, and they're gonna make you really happy no matter what kind of user you are, but a little bit of guidance can be helpful to know what you're getting into. If you did enjoy this video, and if you like more coffee educational videos and videos about products and comparisons and reviews, be sure to get signed up to our newsletter. We've got a link below for that. It's also gonna get you alerted to all of our deals and sales as soon as they happen. If you did like this video, hit that like button, drop a comment if you've got questions, and get subscribed for more of our best of 2022 videos. Thanks. Oh, yes.